Today is day 362 of web development, and it is also Saturday, July 16th, 2022, and I'm just going to do like a card today, um, so I'll open up my document, open up my HTML tags, um, I'm going to use fonts today, so I'll put in my head tag, and then my body tags, which is where everything in the screen is going to be in. So I'll start with a div, give it a class container because it's going to be containing everything on my page. Um, let me see, close that in there and then inside is going to be my div and it's going to be called class card and I'll put that in there and then I'll go to my CSS and target the container by using dot notation and give it a border property, values 5 pixel black solid lined container, height 100 vertical height of the screen. Um, and then for my card, I'll give it also a border, 5 pixels black solid, and a height, I don't know, maybe a, I don't know, what should I give it? Um, sure. Um, and then I want my card to be in the middle of the container, so I'll give the container a display of flex. And then I'll justify the content in my container um, and put it center so that does it horizontally. And then align items, center does it vertically. And then I should give my card a width of 25%, something like that. Um, maybe I'll do 80% and then... 45 percent 30 35 35 and then I'll also give it a border radius of 20 pixels and then I'll give it a background of I'll say hold on I have a color here that I picked out um probably oops Something like this one, maybe. And then for the body itself, I'll give it a background of um, this blue color. Oops. What? There we go. And then I'll also do myself a favor and just get rid of any um, default margin and padding. Alright, save that. And then I'll be able to see um, it into bug mode over here. Okay. Ew. Um, let me see. I'll probably give the container, should I give the container or the card, maybe the container a margin of 50 pixels? Sure. Um, then the card itself, let me see. The card, I want there to be a, let's say a div, class, card, content. And in there, I need, let's say, an H1 for the title, whatever, heading, um, a paragraph, lorem tab, and then like a button. Oops. All right, and then I need there to be a thumbnail. So I'll do div class thumbnail. All right, and then the thumbnail is going to have background. I don't know, I'll just kind of see what I like. I think I pulled up like an ice cream image. Right click copy image 
and then URL, put that in there. All right, and then I'll give it a height of, I don't know, 25%. Um, background size, cover, and then background position center, so it's at the center. Um, I could also give it a height, just change the height, just kind of play around with it. I don't know, maybe like that. And then give it the same border radius as I did the card. I don't know, what was it, 20 pixels? Yeah. Alright, but then, oh no, because then... But you know what I could do, though? I could um, tell it 0, 0, 20, 20? Pixels? Oh, it was the opposite. Great. Um, 20 pixels, 20 pixels, 0, 0. There we go. Alright, let me see what that looks like over here. Horrid. Alright, how about... Huh, even the heading goes, um, I don't want it to be so ill. I mean, like, look at it. I need the height to be different. So how about I just do media query, media max width, let's say 800 pixels, and then I'll tell it to have those properties over here. Um... No, the card and this would go in here and then I would change this to be responsive but over here so the width definitely needs to change of the card so maybe 25 whoops 25% here so that's looking good and then the height could be well maybe I could do 30% no 25% and then 90 and then it would make sense to do 30 Shmm, I don't know I don't even like it how about maybe it's the colors that are off I'm trying to think so maybe let me switch colors so I'll do the body to be this color while I take this color and put it over here for the um where is it the card the background put that there no no all right i'm just gonna stick with the colors that i always use unless i don't want to i don't know it just feels really weird actually i'll use maybe this color I love that it's a designing part where I always go wrong. Not wrong, but slow. FFF. Or white. It's just weird. I don't know. Whatever. Alright, so then... Let me think. I could have the height of the thumbnail be a little bit more, like 50%. 60 all right, so that's good. And then I can just say margin, bottom, 10 pixels, so just space between the image, right, and the, um, what do you call it, the, uh, the thing, what do you call it? The, the card content, yes. Um, and then one more thing, the card over here needs to change the background. All right. And then, not only that, but there also needs to be card content, there needs to be padding in there. So padding 20 pixels, okay, and then the card content, H1 needs to have a margin bottom of, I don't know, 10 pixels same thing with the p which is the paragraph 
and then the card needs to have a height of min content actually hold on um over here i'll set it to be min content so it's the great but then the thumbnail doesn't have a certain height does it 45 percent 45 percent so that wouldn't make sense to do that so i guess i'll just change it to be 100 that's really ugly 95 sure all right so now it's looking like that and then i can just do like a certain button Ooh, i'll do like a brown black button so i'll go here and do wrong thing card content that's not how you spell card content okay a and then give it a background i don't know let me use my color picker something like this no something like that give it that background and give some padding of maybe 10 pixels um, give it a border radius of 20 pixels so yeah 20 pixels or maybe not I don't even know um, then text decoration none to remove the underline and then color white um, and then let's give it a margin top 20 pixels or not because that should be the button okay so how about i just do dot card content which is kind of gonna override what i just wrote at the top um margin bottom 20 pixels there we go and then i should probably change what it says so maybe um what should i do buy or like add to cart Ooh, I could do taste. Nice, I think that's a little bit nicer. So it's looking like that, and then I should probably change the height over here of the card itself to be 92%. Or not, okay, let's do 95. All right, so that's good. Um. I just want it to be a little bit wider, so I'll go over here and maybe give it a width instead of a padding. I just don't know. What is it? Like maybe 60 pixels or is that too small? Oh, weird. The width doesn't apply, so I wonder. I could always just do, okay, so it goes like a clock, so it's a top, so 10 pixels at the top, then at the right I want 20 pixels, and then bottom 10 pixels, and then left 20 pixels. Right. Beautiful. Okay, that's a lot better. And then when I hover over it, I need something to happen, so I'll do card content, a hover, whoops. And then I need the background to change to another color, um, which should probably be darker. So I'll just go um, and get the color of the background here, go over here, change that color, and then get shader and probably, should I do a lighter color? Doesn't make sense, right? Something like that, copy that, and then go back to my code pen and then paste that in there. And then when I hover over it, it should turn darker. Alright, and then the card itself, when I hover over the card, I need it to, relative to its previous position, to move from the top negative two pixels. Alright, so let me do that. So when I hover over it, negative two position, because I cannot spell. relative 
Hello, relative position. What in the world? Okay, I don't know what that just what just happened. All right, so the card position. Yeah, exactly. So why is it not working? Oh, there we go. All right, and then let me just remove the border so it looks nice and clean. All right, so this is what it's looking like. Um, and then, is there anything else that I want to do? You know what I could do? Maybe I could try something new. Hold on. Maybe for the border radius for the um, A. All right, I can do... Let me figure it out. So zero, zero, 20 pixels, 20 pixels. No, I want zero. No, that's not what I want. Um, oh, so it goes by zero, zero. So it goes like weird, zero, 20. I thought I wanted like a clock. Huh. So I want this to be 20 pixels, 20 pixels, and then zero. No, that's literally not what I want. <sighs> okay, how does this go? 20 pixels. So this one controls this one. It's the opposite? That's weird. So this one is... No, this one I do want it to be 20. Then this one I want it to be zero pixels. And then this one I also want to be zero pixels, and this one I want to be 20 pixels. Got it. Nope, that's actually literally the opposite of what I wanted. What the heck? Alright, um, zero pixels, 20 pixels, 20 pixels, zero, and then let me remove this. All right, that's what I wanted to do. Does that look weird? Does that look weird? I don't know. Is it a weird design? It probably is. I just like the way that it's all like, you know, what do you call it? Um, uh, aligned. No, I think I'm gonna leave it how it was. Um, how was it? I forgot. Twenty pixels, right? All right. Okay, I think that's that. And then let me remove the border of the container. Where is the container? Okay. Remove the border there. Save that. Reload. And that's it for today, right? I think that's good. Right. Maybe I should do this a little bit more. Maybe go to HTML. Change it to, um... I don't know. Ice cream names. No. <sighs> hey, what? Well, Chocolate, French vanilla. Ooh, dulce de leche. Dulce de leche. Oh, you know what's one thing I forgot? The fonts. Let me see if I could kind of find a really good match. Um, ooh, maybe this one. Nice. Alright, let me look at the fonts. Um... I'll come back when I find a font. Alright, I'm gonna try this one and I'm gonna co I'm gonna select the um four hundred. Go here, copy the link, go to my code pen, go to HTML, and then go to head and paste that in there, and then just use that and then maybe um 
I can just apply everything to the body. Oh no, that's no, that's so ugly. All right, not this one. Let me try to find another one. Honestly, at this point, it's better if I just don't use any fonts. I think it looks fine the way that it is. Um, why is there still a border? Oh. Get rid of that. Alright, um, I think I'm gonna leave it like that. Alright, and that's pretty much it. Bye.